What up, Fish Tank people? FishTankTV.com, Dustin's Fish Tanks, bringing it to you on a Sunday, baby. It's Species ah! Sunday, and I got my daughter Maya yelling in the mix just like her dad. Because that's how we teach them how to do it. Inside, making a yelling video, which I'm excited to do because I'm never inside yelling. But I am fired up today, folks. You know why? couple of housekeeping things, that's why. I went through, I don't know why I didn't do this earlier, but I went through and I did a playlist of the Species Sunday. You've got two hours and 39 minutes on your hands. You can sit down and watch like 50 Species Sunday in a row on my channel, check them all out. I went through, I also made a Rainbow Fish playlist, I think it was about two hours long, doing some cichlid playlists next. So I'm excited about that, I just went through and, and lining it up. Let me know what kind of playlist you wanna see and I will hook it up for you. It's very mind numbing going through 700 and some videos to do it, but I'm doing it for you because I got love for the people. I'm still in love mode from Valentine's Day. Here's what's going on, I wanna talk to you today about a very special plant to me. More, taste it, you know you want it. This right here, not the other one, is Tall Sag. Let me show you the 75. Oh yeah, having a lot of fun here. I came down here yesterday at two o'clock and I saw this girl and this boy getting nasty right over there, breeding some rainbows. And it was crazy. I was like, oh man, I saw eggs flying everywhere. I got a clown loach in there. So I highly doubt that any of the eggs are left. I didn't even try to salvage them because frankly, I don't want to see what those babies, I do want to see what those babies look like, but I got enough baby rainbows as it is. So I, uh, I let them go, but it was very cool. I was like, I hadn't seen rainbows uh, going at it in a while. Please excuse the noise that's about to make. Yeah, honey, we'll play with that in just one second here. Hop on up here with Daddy. But I want to talk today about the sads because I got it going on back here. I love it. I think it's awesome. It's different than jungle vowel. It's got a narrower leaf. It's a little sturdier of a plant, too. Um, the stuff you see in the front here is actually onion plants. I am about sold out of those in aquatic jungles. By the way, if you're ordering plants for me, which a lot of you have been, uh, the cutoff is Sunday night at 5 o'clock, so basically now. Oh, throwing toys. But um, that's what's up. I want to talk about the plant, though. Um, real skinny. Maya's holding it now. Hold it for Daddy. Hold it there, Maya. Hold it, yeah. Um, look at the roots on this thing, though. This plant has uh, different roots than the... Let me give it to Daddy. Well, she took the species Sunday. That's what we're doing here. Um, yeah, put it in there. Go ahead. I've got this plant, and I want... This is the roots <coughs> of the Sagittarius, and I've got the uh, roots of... Hold on, my jungle vowel. Jungle vowel has thinner roots, and also they're curly, and it's it's a little bit wider of a plant. This is jungle vowel right here, so you're gonna want to check the difference there. Um, I like the Sagittarius more because it's a little sturdier, a little stiffer when you touch the leaves. So uh, definitely something you want to check out. And of course, I've got the Sag regular down here, which is a lot of fun. And then over here, here, Maya, you hold on to the jungle vowel. Since here, take this, sweetie. Hold the jungle vowel. Then over here, I've got Sagittaria chinensis. Oh, by the way, the 220 coming along. I got some work to do, but um, the chinensis over here, Sagittaria chinensis. Where are you, Sagittaria chinensis? Here you are. And this is a cool piece of Sag too right here. So, And this, I will like to say too, I floated this to let it get some roots and in two weeks time it's grown roots that are uh, adequate enough to plant. So I've just had this floating underneath the halide and it's doing quite well. Um, you always want to trim off the bad leaves by the way, people ask me that all the time. So that's what I'm doing, Sagittaria, get you tall, it's, it's Sagittaria. Um, giant Sag, and then you got Sagittaria chinensis, and then you got Dwarf Sag. So, real pumped about the species. You definitely stuff you want to try out. I love my beginner plants. Uh, shout out to my guy Mike. In uh, he is out in Nevada. Dude just sent me a gold touch combo. Wants to do a gold touch combo. He's got a 240 with foot long plecos, and he wants me to put plants in it. I'm scared to death to take that order because I know his fish are going to screw it all up. But it's going to be an exciting, uh, exciting tank to set up. And I'm real looking forward to doing that. So that's what's up. Welcome new subscribers. Check out the Species Sunday playlist along with the uh, Rainbow Fish playlist. And let me know. Everybody have an awesome week. Later.